Brad Laird embarks on his first season as the head coach at NSU, expect to hear a lot of jazz. No, no, not jazz music. Jazz Ferguson. The transfer receiver is getting ready for his first action with the Demons, but his road to Natchitoches didn't follow the traditional path. I play football every year besides last year, so for me to have to sit down the whole entire year and not compete in on one of the competitions, it, it hit hard. Ferguson spent his first two seasons playing for the LSU Tigers. Hey, 103,000 people screaming at you every Saturday, that's different. But during his sophomore year with the Tigers, he was suspended following a failed drug test. After that, I really, I, I took a fall. I wasn't really going to class like I was supposed to. I just, I, I went about the wrong way. I, I didn't realize the academic was the reason I was playing football. I was just there to play football. With his academics in trouble, Ferguson needed a change of scenery. Enter the Demons, but it didn't come without a catch. Ferguson needed to redshirt his first year in Natchitoches to get his grades in check. You know, anytime something's taken away, away from you, you know, the ability to, to play the game that you love, um, then, you know, how are you going to handle that? And he knew that was his uh, uh, opportunity to get back on the field as he had to handle his business off the field. Fast forward a year, Ferguson is fully eligible and putting a bigger emphasis on the student part of student athletes. It showed everybody in the locker room that without the grades, you would not be able to play football. So when you're watching the Demons this season, you're sure to see Ferguson make some plays. Now that I'm able to bring this fire out, it feels so much better. And when things really get clicking in Demon Land, you might even hear a little jazz. Reporting in Natchitoches, I'm Brad Cisak.